Hello and welcome to a tour of Star Citizen now for 3.14 around Orizon. Uh, Horizon. Zin, what, what, is it Orizon or Horizon? Who knows? I'm not entirely sure. No one knows. No one. Chris Roberts says Horizon, but Chris has been wrong <laughs> a lot before in the way he pronounces things. Um, so we're at Green Circle. This is our Habs. Um, so there's 17 floors here. And there's a little roof and a lobby area. But it's very sort of similarly constructed to, um, well, a mixture of Microtech and um, Lawville. So Microtech, um, New Babbage, and uh, Hurston Lawville sort of construction. They reuse some of the assets or um, have similar sort of builds in mind. It's uh, Orison at night as well, so you have to bear with us if you wanted to see it during the day. Well, join us another time. Um, it's pretty, it's dark. We're going to have a look at some of the Blossom Gardens. We're going to have a look at pff, whatever. Zin, Zin, where are you? I'm, I'm in my hab. I just turned the lights off. Oh, nice. Um, meet me on the roof. I, I was talking to Zin about it earlier. This is basically, this whole area is a floating balcony. Um, and a lot of it does not have railings. Um, so you've got to be kind of careful. Mortality is high. So all the sort of mod cons you can expect from a landing zone, minus some that haven't been finished yet. Uh, and we'll have a look at the uh, what's going on with each of the little platforms and areas because it is a series of platforms that are stuck together um, and linked together via a little shuttle system. But even at night, look how pretty this is. Like... Oof. Go to the roof. There are problems with the gas clouds. As you can see, they're sort of a bit fuzzy, artifacting. Um, they're working on that. Um, there's a lot more stuff they want to do with the gas clouds. See some of the, these platforms moving a bit, moving around. I'm not sure how many leaves and blossoms these trees have to constantly be shedding them. But apparently a lot. Um, Genetically modified cherry blossom. Do you know what? That's probably it. We've got Zin here. She's going to be my faithful assistant today. Uh, and we're going to do a bit of a tour of Orison. So come on, Zin. Let's uh, let's go down to the lobby. So in the lobby, you were like, where's the spa earlier, weren't you? Yes. So if you go up the stairs, yeah. you see there's a sign that says spa. Yeah. There is no spa. There is well, there is. No, there isn't. There is yeah. only... Yeah. This puddle of water. <laughs> so there's a puddle of water. Yeah. I, I suspect in the future these doors might lead off to a, more spa things. Yeah. So we've got a puddle of water, but we also have gym. Yes, but gym is not spa. But it's part of spa, right? So you've got a little, little gym area as well on each side. Oh, hello. I'm a concierge, don't you know? You can tell <laughs> <laughs> by the way he walks and the, the monocle. Um, yeah, you've got so, weights, weights room this side, other side you've got um, your uh, runny stuff. Runny stuff? What's it called? When yeah, yeah, runny run? stuff. A, a, cardio. Uh, yeah, card a cardio room. Yeah. Oh, and, and also your, let's not forget mats. the gym mats. Where's my, where's my spin class? No, but you, you, no spin class, just air walk class. Okay, yeah, yeah, it's walking on air. And that's appropriate. So yeah, this is Green Circle, this is the Hab Block. But it's part of the Cloud View Centre platform. And this is the more commercial style platform is the idea. There's a little plaza. You've got a variety of these little signs just explaining what's going on with Law in Crusader and people that are important. But I mean, in Crusader. people should know that already because they watched my law video, right? Yeah, the lighting in this area is absolutely phenomenal because they've really gone the extra mile to make it look great at night as well as during the day. And they sort of like they want this area to be super pretty. As I said, the, the cherry blossoms. <laughs> there's a little bit too many of them. Um, so what else have we got, Zin? You said this so is the carry this, on round, this is the front, yeah. Nice picture across the way. We've got the uh, the the. Space wall statue. Space wall. So that's where the Stratus uh, shopping center is going to be eventually. Well, it's there. It's there. Um, and well, actually, let's see what we can access off that in a minute. But back here, we've got this is the the sneaky back entrance to the uh, 
green circle, perhaps. But I suppose you want to go in and out of the sneaky back entrance if you want to get immediately to the shuttles. Yeah. Because sure. you've got the shuttle station station shuttle, here. Shuttle here. Um, got a little map as well. Oh, here, here comes the shuttle. And we'll, we'll go on the shuttle in a bit. We'll explore station. this platform fully. So we've got three platforms basically that we can visit. We're on the Cloudview Center platform at the moment. Uh, there's the industrial platform and the August Dunno spaceport platform. Um, obviously, when you land at the zone rather than spawn here, uh, you're going to the spaceport and then taking the the tram in, the shuttle in. So if you come over here, this uh, I assume is going to be the Crusader showroom, but this is where you're going to be able to buy um, mostly Crusader ships like the Mercury Star Runner and all that sort of jazz. Not not on the industrial platform. No, so I originally thought it was going to be on the industrial platform. Okay. Um, but see, coming soon, and this is supposed to be the commercial, the commercial platform. So, mm. okay. I suppose I know one way to settle this. We look at the map, so it will say what um, features are supposed to be there, like menswear level two. Yes. Which is only available in uh, the Stratus Shopping Center, obviously. Cloudview Center Crusader Industry Showroom. Yeah, yeah. Okay, it is on cool. this one. Um, so, should we run across to see the Last Space Narwhal? Yes. Are you impressed with this zone, Zin, or do you think uh, yeah, pretty? I like it. I think it's yeah. pretty nice. It, it's by far my favorite landing zone by like some margin. I love, I love the little whale. I like the whale He's because... He's a little whale. Well, he is for the size of the whales that we're eventually going to have mm. when, they're, when they're alive. And they are working on them at the moment. But I'm, I'm not... I sort of like the fake water. I mean, it's not not super proper water yet. Um, but I like the fact that when I look at that statue, that is something that I can imagine existing in real life. The sort of fountain there and everything. There's just huge amounts on the platforms of just areas that you can go to look and observe things and if you are just a star citizen tourist well i mean this is the an amazing place to come to especially because it's new but it is genuinely beautiful so you've got stratus cloudview center stratus at cloudview center so i suppose this stratus is shopping mall yeah so what we got here so we got some shops that are not open yet or are coming soon um Oh, I really like this. What a shop with the um, with the clothing of uh, Crusader. I do like the Crusader security uniforms, though. They're pretty cool. I think we're going to be able to buy a lot of the Crusader gear. Actually, it looks, just looks like a fancy uh, like jumpsuit. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So do you like the sort of like... Um, no. 50s style no. Americana. No. It's, a, it's a weird take, but I mean, it is very... I like the suits. I like the, the smart wear. I don't like these fluffy blouse things. No. With the cover bun type stuff going on. Can you imagine Zen wearing these, our friend? No. no? Zen's got better style than that. He does. He'd be wearing them as smarter like, dresses. Mm. <laughs> uh, I quite like this. This, this is some... Some of the smart wear is pretty cool. Yes, I don't, I'm not a massive fan of the, the 50s Americana, but it, it does give it a sense of, you know, a very unique style, for sure. How long is it going to take? Oh, oh, that's, that's me in underwear. Huh. Your underwear is different than it used to be. Yeah, they've changed it, haven't they? Yeah. Am I in my underwear? Uh, no, you're in your normal clothes. That's right, I'll clip it so this bit will be seamless. Just like Star Citizen, eh? What's we got over here? Kelto? Which seems to be a... Oh, you can get narwhals. Uh, so space walls. This is an amazing shop. This has got... Some of, uh, so this is Finley, the narwhal, but we also have Francis and the storm, yeah. st Stormwall. Um, so this is an amazing shop. So it's got a load of like 
Snacks and treats. Oh, it's got nachos. We've got, got some nachos. Um, I'd like it to have. I'd like it to get some sushi in as well. Oh, that would fruits. Um, I like but then that. Also, a load of guns. Um, <laughs> which is just fantastic. Just what you wanted. Are you wearing a jacket now? You look very smart. And you're wearing. You're smart as well. You're wearing like a, a little, uh, little Sudi Mabob waistcoat. That's the one. Cool. Matching pants. And upstairs, I think we've only got uh, whammers, and that's it. So yeah, there's other shops that will be opening up later. Um, you've got the FTL Courier still, so you've got drop-off missions potentially to here. Mm-hmm. Um, and then there's other shops opening up in the future. Let's go up the elevator to the Voyager Bar. Oh, I, lo- I love this as a little shopping centre. This reminds me, I, there's a shopping centre that I used to go to as a kid called the Marlin Centre, which was, in my head, very similar to this. But if I'd looked at it now, it would just be this horrible trash thing. I think my game... No? Oh, I've crashed. Congrats, Sin. Congrats. Here we go. And I'm still in the elevator. Oh, wow. Congrats. Um, oh, I'm up. I'm upstairs. All right, let's uh, let's wait for everything to load in. All right, I'm gonna call the elevator. I'm hoping that's not oh, gonna kill you. Now I'm at the bottom floor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna call the elevator up. Yeah, yeah, yeah I'm coming up. Wow, you are super jank. You are extra janky today, Zin. Thanks. Nice. It must be the a new landing zone. Um, so we're up in the Voyager bar, the Sky bar, basically. Um, yeah, there's a party You'll going on. Something important missing from this bar. Is it the barman? It's the barman. Or bar in person. Uh, one day we'll get bar people that work. Uh, however, however, tech. if you go outside. Yeah. Where are you? Oh, I'm well. coming. Uh, is it this way? This is where all the bar staff are. Okay, so they just haven't populated the bar in there properly. Okay. So we've got that some some use of fire here on some open coals. I think that if I was drunk, this would be pretty dangerous. Um, this is a lawsuit waiting to happen soon over here. Does it hurt if you walk on it? No, it's, it's a fake fire. Oh no, okay. no, 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 that hurt. I'm, I'm, I've taken health damage. You deserve it. It's right, dip your feet in this um, champagne bucket. That'll make me feel better, thank you. Yeah, it's okay. Although, it's not full of ice, it's full of crystals. Uh, intersect weirdly with the bottles of champagne. That's confusing my brain. Um, but yeah, so, cool little sky bar um, for little social events and for looking out over your sort of domain of um, horizon. Reason, reason. Oh wow! You only just see the aquarium. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Let's go have a look at the hospital. It's not much to it at the moment, but people have been trying to steal the trolleys. Oh yes, and other things. And the gurneys. <laughs> wow. So this is why. This is why you shouldn't privatise, eh? Mm-hmm. People just try and steal everything. Thing with the NHS is that in, they in the UK... They were trying to walk it in? No. It's that we all own it anyway, so there's no point in stealing it. All oh, right, I see. Yeah. I see. So we actually have the hospital here already. Yeah, an, an IV stand that's fallen over. Yeah, yeah. Pharmacy. Get all your drugs. Insurance, so you can insure your body. Can I buy from the pharmacy? Is it MedPens? Probably. MedPens and OxyPens at the moment, so cool. Yeah, I, I guess once they bring in the uh, the more complex stuff, you'll be able to buy it from here. Yeah. Or well, maybe you'll be able to buy Hi. stuff that literally to sell, so medical supplies in general. Although it's more of a pharmacy, isn't it? I suppose it's more consumer based. Mm. Yeah, so this is the. Um, Medical Insurance Centre. Mm-hmm. Okay, that's cool. 
maybe be able to regenerate our lives there at some point. And then I've got D block, Department of Genetics. Okay. Can't go in there though. And that's pretty much it, really. The wheelchair's in. I know. I want a wheelchair. <laughs> we want a wheelchair race. Uh, what are these? Welcome to Oros and General Genetics Department. Please confirm your appointment. Ah, cool. So yeah, that's that's pretty much it. So yeah, the hospital will open up more in the future. Mm -hmm. We've got a little bit of a basis for it. Yes, yeah, there's elevators here that you can't get to. I'm assuming you would come down in an elevator or spawn in an area that you can't otherwise get to when you yeah. die. Um, that's the idea. Uh, also, something I wanted to point out is these hand sanitizers. Yeah. Yeah. UV, UVC. Yeah. 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 UVC. That's the bad UV. That's the UV that kills. Yeah, but it kills the germs in your hands. Don't and then gives you cancer. Oh. That's literally what UVC does. It's the bad one. Oh. But yeah, so that's that's Oris in general. I love you, Oris in general. Oris in general loves you. Oh, the little shuttle. Let's get on one of the shuttles in. So this one will take us to the um, industrial platform. Okay. So yeah, let's go to the industrial platform before the spaceport. That makes sense, right? Yes. So the one on the other side will take us to the spaceport. Mm -hmm. And if we stayed on this one, it would take us to the spaceport. Oh, wow. Okay, yeah. I really like it. It's like, it's, it looks really cozy and... But it looks like something that I would want in the future. This public transport like this is cool. Yeah. No driver, nice and clean. Reminds me of the DLR. DLR? Uh, Docklands Light Railway in London. Okay. Let's, let's get off. Whoop. Last call for passengers. The shuttle is preparing to depart. So, let's have a quick look at the map to see what we've got here. So, we're on the industrial platform. Mm -hmm. The Providence Industrial Platform. Providence. So, we've got Crusader Discovery Center, Covalex Shipping and Self Storage, Cousin Crow's Custom Craft, uh, Tammy and Sons Outfitters, and Orison Municipal Services. So, the Kovalex shipping and uh, self-storage and the sort of, like, general cargo and freight areas for missions are here. Mm -hmm. um, and we'll access those in a minute. I'll have a look at them. The Crusader Discovery Center that we've got here is eventually, I believe, going to be where you can see, like, the tours of Crusader. And there's going to be tour guides walking around. And I think you might actually be able to uh, do some stuff there. Um, but there's sort of, like, more of a novelty shop and a sort of, like, little learning center, really. Um, Cousin Crows. That's going to be after market customization for your ship eventually, which is something that should be pretty exciting when they actually bring it. Um, or some municipal services? I didn't oh. see it, but municipals like guns and stuff, isn't it? Oh, relating to a town or district and its governing bodies. Wow, I was wrong. Oh, municipal. You, like government services. And town services, yes. And town services. So I guess for like housing and offices and stuff like that. Not munition services. Not munitions. Uh, <laughs> I really like these. I really like the, the spacecraft um, little statues, models, whatever they are. Yeah, so something that Star Citizen do very well is uh, sort of set pieces and building these landing zones. I'm not sure if they're as good as like the Fallout guys at building uh, narrative um, little stories in a small area with very little but um, Star Citizen is incredibly beautiful and the sort of set pieces and statues and uh, dressing that they do is fantastic look over here just come over here and look at this Hercules being built or repaired so I'm, I'm just buying this uh, looks like a salami uh, <laughs> yes the Hercules got a Hercules being built over here or being repaired or serviced um, so that's pretty cool Right. Should we have a look uh, more around the industrial platform? Uh, yes. So, if we go... Where are we? Where are you? Come this I'm, way. I'm behind you. I'm following you. If we go this there's, way. There's a load of little things around here. Like, there's engineering sections. There's escape pods. There's the cargo I'm area. Up, that way, up, up here. So, here's the Kovalex shipping. 
Uh, yeah, so this is basically a, a little cargo deck. Uh, it's the idea here. Mm -hmm. The same services, little shop. You can get your cargo missions. Self storage. I assume that's going to be relevant when we have loads of shit. Yeah, most likely. Um, but you'll be able to do your drop off missions here. You can buy um, the gear here. I wonder if it's running at the moment. I well, the, think it the, might the be giant, actually this. The giant cargo rumba. Yeah, so this is what scared me. Um, I actually found the point where I fell off as well. It was at the corner over there. But it started moving. And I was like, oh my god, you move. Like, I've never seen anything that big. Because you've seen these sort of things around, I'm sure. Zen. Yeah. Zen. Yeah. What about the spaceships? What about the spaceships? They're pretty big and they no, move. No, but you know what I mean. Like, little... Look at it, isn't it cool? Uh, I mean, I love him. He's a little little cargo rumba. Can I jump on him? No, you can't. But you're actually, I actually fell down this gap here. Don't, don't do that again. So you've got sort of like um, engineering S sections. Eventually these mm -hmm. might be used for missions. You can go up and down the ladders here as well if you want to feel very uncomfortable. Mm-hmm. Um, I just Where like the you? whole engineering, like the industrial platform actually has barriers. Yes. So not everywhere has barriers. We're going to go around here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, oh, skate pods. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, it's also all the way to Cousin Crow's place, which I hadn't yes. seen before. Which I guess is here. Yeah. So this is where Cousin Crow's will be. Looking forward to that because that means we have customization for ships and some modular stuff as well. Mm-hmm. A uh, lot of smoke and stuff going on here. It's industrial, mate. It is industrial. That's how you know it's industrial. Also, lots of cloud tech going on. Uh, so... Is this an escape pod? These are escape pods, I believe. If you look, these hatches on the floor. The little round hatches, yeah. Yeah. Oh, I see. And then if you come over here, I think Hi. these are giant coolant tanks. Well, it does say uh. flammable rather than... Is coolant flammable? I suppose it could be. Uh, it could be, couldn't it? But it's some form of chemical needed to keep the platform up, probably. Question yeah. mark. You can tell that these are escape pods because it says escape pod on the floor. Does it? Oh yeah, escape pod with a big arrow. I think that's all that's really around on this. Yeah, like anything else is just weird. Um, just like pathways to other areas that we've already been to yeah and there's lots of pretty stuff to explore for sure um little, little balconies and things uh, also if you are in the cargo bay area there are areas which are trespass areas and it will warn you it will say don't go in here um so just sort of be aware of that right back to the shuttle back to the shuttle i'll meet you there I've got a 30k in. Oh, 30k. It's fine, because we're going to take the shuttle. Right. So, we had a 30k. That is the first 30k either of us have had during the uh, Wave 1 PT build. Please clear the house. Today. But now we're uh, on our way to the spaceport. Approaching next station. If this is your stop, please prepare to disembark. Is this your stop? Is my stop, Sim? Please prepare to disembark. I am... I'm ready. So, around this area, we've got, well, ship rentals, uh, ship spawn, um, I think we've got some food with Elroys and ra uh, Whammers. Um, yeah, I think there's food up on the main uh, area. But there's a... it's a big tram station, basically, so... Should we, uh, should we jump on the elevator, shall we? Yeah, all the best stuff's upstairs. It is, indeed. It's more of, sort of like a waiting lobby for your, your shuttle. Why do you look like a bald Elon Musk? What do you mean? That's, everyone wants to look like a bald Elon Musk. <laughs> so, you can... Is this a rent? Or... Yeah, it's rentals there. Let me know if there's yeah. anything I can help you with. What can you rent here? You can rent uh, an a Aegis Adventure Titan, an Anvil no, Arrow, Mustang yet. Alpha, Mustang Gamma, Dragonfly, 300i, uh, Aurora ES, 
constellation Andromeda, Tumbral Cyclone, and an, an, an Aeopernox. Aeopa? Aeopa. 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 Finley! Got more space whales upstairs. Finley, I want the big Finley one. and Francis. Got a little snack shop here. Om nom nom. Cool little balconies. Some people wearing the Americana gear, which is weird. So look at look at her. Look at her with her lovely blouse. I hate it. I hate it. It's horrible. <laughs> but, so I haven't actually looked at what's over here. Is there anything over here? So that's the VIP area oh, over here. Oh, chairman's club. So eventually, so Hello, I'm not sure. I'm a chairman. I'm not a chairman. The million mile high club is this going to be? Is the million mile high club going to be different from the chairman's club? Because only very few people have access to the million mile high club, but the chairman's club will be all concierge. Yeah. Um, so I'm interested to know what's going on, what's what. Should we have a bit more of a look around? I mean, there's only really the hangers left now. We can have a look at oh, the hangers. Oh, and Elroy's. And a Whammers. And a Whammers. Whammers! Huh. 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 Uh, and then we've got the terminals for the ships. Yeah. I tried uh, spawning a hornet earlier, and it glitched yeah. through the floor. So by the time I got to the hangar, it had disappeared. Is that... Better or worse than when they're happy boys to see you? Uh, probably worse because it's not as interesting. Yeah, so. But either way, I have no ship to use. So, the majesty of this landing zone is just amazing. It. It's just a big floating lattice. And that must have been hard to actually make look right. Rather than it look trash, like quite genuinely. So shuttles. Woo. See, there's one below us oh, on the yeah, left. Yeah, I see him. He's gonna come out the other side, or you could just follow the one that comes out here now. <laughs> oh, sin! Oh, where do I feel like we're gonna die? We're not gonna die. We're fine. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. That's typically the last me. last words you say, isn't it? Before we die. Before we get hit by a shuttle in the rear, it just explodes us. He's gone. He's gone. Where did he go? Keep, keep on going that way. Keep on going that way. Oh, 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 oh! Shuttle, shuttle, shuttle. Below us. Shuttle. Below us is the is the um hard platform. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. You found it. What the f- Oh, okay, I'm being autopiloted. So you can't go too close. That's annoying! Which is why you, you are occasionally seeing ships explode and fall out of the sky. Yeah, because autopilot kills you. Yeah, autopilot does not like people. So yeah, that's, that's about as close as we'll be able to get. Wish I could have Dropping a ship as fast as that shuttle. Autopilot going again. They're pretty, pretty nippy, aren't they? Mm. I tell you what, this reminds me very much of Star Trek. This is very Star Trek-y. Or that episode of um, Stargate from the future. Yeah, yeah, I know that. I know what you mean. Yeah, yep. Yeah. It's got that sort of utopian, clean vibe. This is the that is the provenance platform because you can see by the sign. Oh yeah, and there's the shuttle. Nope, and there's the autopilot. I'm going to fly you into the center of the planet. Hmm. Thanks, autopilot. It's okay. In conclusion, Orison is pretty, y'all. Oh, look, there's a Hercules. A Starlufter. Oh. 
below us, having a, having a look as well. It's a pity you can't see the one that they're working on. Looks pretty much like that one though, doesn't it? Yeah, pretty much. This has been a beautiful little tour of Orison and the associated platforms around it. Uh, hopefully you'll be able to jump in and take a look yourself. It's wave one at the moment, but it will go out to more waves in the coming days. And then open PTU, hopefully within uh, about a week or so, is what I'm hoping. And then live in the not-too-distant future. Um, check it out. Tell me what you think. Say goodbye, Zin. Goodbye, Zin. Perfect. Hey, I heard you like VPNs. How about NordVPN, then? It's got things like security and features. And we all know chicks dig VPNs. Oh my god, is that Nord? Well, yes. Yes, it is. Wink. Check out the links below to get discounts or go to nordvpn.com forward slash board gamer. Maybe it will align your shackles or something. Actually, let's read some testimonials. Ever since I got NordVPN, my life is good. I wish I'd got NordVPN sooner. I didn't get NordVPN and now I've got no hands. I'm sorry that I recorded this as an ad sin. I, I apologize to my editor. I said I wouldn't go too wacky. That's that's not what's happened here. Every month we have a ship giveaway and for July it's for a Constellation Taurus with lifetime insurance and a Star Citizen game package. All you need to play! This long overdue, more cargo focused version of the Constellation is going to be flyable in July. It's basically a new ship. Woo! Sort of. Uh, to be in for a chance of winning that, comment on any of my videos made during July and each video gives you another chance to win but only one comment is counted per video. More details down below. Please also consider supporting the channel further via the YouTube join button or via Patreon or donation or whatever. It all helps us make Star Citizen content, great Star Citizen content, hopefully, or at least some Star Citizen content. Also, you should bother the bell and like and subscribe and all that sort of jazz as well. Thanks for watching.